are your pastures looking like this rather than like this? Maybe it's just my trait that I like order or maybe I need to better understand Pokemon, but I found it too overwhelming having all my Pokemon in the one pasture, so I wanted to rearrange them. The system that I found works best for me is to have a Noah's Ark of Pokemon, so I'd grab a male and female of each evolution and since each row holds up to three pairs of evolution, for any Pokemon that didn't have a third, I'd reserve that third spot for Alphas or Shinies. The benefit of this was that I had a visual cue in my pastures along with my Pokedex to know which gender I'd still need or which Pokemon I needed. Here's an example of sorting them based on evolution and gender. So Flytool is an evolution of Buizel, so I'll put this one in the first evolution slot. Note, since this is an alpha and there's no second evolution, I'll later put this into the third pair slot. As you go through this sorting exercise, you'll come across multiples of a given Pokemon. If I already have a gender of Pokemon, I just release the lower ranked Pokemon and keep the higher. And then I resort it back into the order again. Doing this gives you the benefit of getting some grit dust or gravel and then upgrade your Pokemon even more. No doubt you'll be faced with decisions like this where two Pokemons are the exact same level, so be mindful of this and choose the one that's got the more fight abilities or have mastered certain moves. Sometimes you'll find Pokemon that are similar looking, but you're not entirely sure whether they're related. Don't worry, just look at the top right of the screen for their ID index to see if the numbers are sequential. What I've found works is I have a pasture of my go-to boss level Pokemon, almost like my bench. I'll rename this one to bosses to keep all my awesome ones and keep a pasture or two for unsorted Pokemon as I catch them. You can choose to keep your boss's pasture as your very last one or your unsorted as your first. You can go so far as to order them based on the number index, which I'm about to do now. I already made a start of this on the very first Pokemon that you catch in the game. Remember, you can move your pastures around if you make progress with your sorting. If you like how this is laid out, I'll leave a link in the description below of how to reserve the rows and pastures. This will save yourself time as you catch so that you don't have to resort them too many times. Do you think this sorting would work for you? Either way, please leave a comment and give the video a like. This was brought to you by Agmanate and like a Pokemon, catch you later!